Hello and welcome to another GCSE revision video. In this video we're going to be looking at the November 2017 past paper of the AQA GCSE 8300 series. This is the third paper in the higher tier. It is a calculator paper so we are allowed to use calculators. And we pick it up in question 14 which reads, in the Venn diagram the universal set represents 20, uh, 31 students in a class. Uh, C is students who have a cat. D is students who have a dog. 14A says one student from the class is picked at random. Work out the probability that the student has a dog. Okay. So six students have a cat, five students have both a cat and a dog, and two X students only have a dog. And there are X plus two students that have neither a cat nor a dog. Uh, I think what we can do is say that six plus five plus two X plus X plus two is going to make the whole number of students, which is 31. So I'm going to say 6 plus 5 plus 2x plus x plus 2 is equal to, and that's 31. Okay, so getting uh, gathering like terms. So I'm going to keep the x's on the left and the y and the uh, numbers on the right. So that's two x plus x is equal to thirty one minus six minus five minus two. So 3x is equal to uh, 6 plus 5 is 11. 11 minus 31 is 20. Uh, 20 minus 2 is 18. Uh, so if 3x is 18, then x equals 6. Okay, so uh, we can now fill in this diagram. So 2 times 6 is 12. So 12 students have a dog, but no cat. Um, so we want to know how many people have, how many students have a dog. So there's a 12 that only have a dog. And there's the 5 that have both a dog and a cat. So 12 plus 5 is 17. So that's 17 out of a total of uh, 31 students in the class. So it's 17 out of 31. Uh, 14b says, one of the students who has a cat is picked at random. Work out the probability that this student has a dog. Okay, so let's have a look. So we're only looking at the number of students that have a cat. So our sample size, so our sample size is equal to 6 plus 5 is 12. Sorry, 6 and 6 is 12. 6 plus 5 is 11. What is wrong with my brain? I'm going loopy. Um, 6 plus 5 equals 11. And our event, what's our event again? Um, work out the probability that this student has a dog. So we're looking for cat owners that have a dog. Well, there are five people that have both a cat and a dog. So the answer is 5 over 11. Our event is 5. So the answer is 5 over 11. Okay, I hope you found that helpful. If you're taking your GCSEs this year, I'd like to wish you every success with your revision and every success with your exams. 
and I look forward to seeing you in another video.